Hey guys, I'm Ren. Um, today we're going to be playing Life is Strange. Let's get started. Choose wisely. start. Oh, uh, okay. Um, I can feel this in my controller. Oh, honey, what are you doing? Go home! Come on, sweetie, let's get up. Where am I? What's happening? Okay. Film, okay. Pieces of time. Uh, all right. But he could be talking what? about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's up. cool. Uh, I'm okay. Uh, it was all a dream, of course. Okay. To shadow. Of course. From color to chiaroscuro. Hey. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Bueller. Bueller. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? Oh, it's I can not hear the class that laughing bad. Now. Come on. Because of her images of hopeless faces, oh, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Uh huh. Uh huh. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. I <laughs> haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Seriously though, I could frame. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Um, I'm gonna let you guys pause and read through this, okay? Any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. She had a brilliant eye. I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. I have to admit. I'm not a big fan. I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. Me too, and I have to get my daily selfie it quota. The essence of post -war beat America. What? And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. But a beauty oh, in the struggle. Daily selfie quota. Okay. You, you don't have beauty uh, without a beat. Right. Which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse. Shh, shh, shh. 
I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. I have to say, the lighting in this Your game is really gorgeous. The first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry. That was terrible. I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh... No. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created oh, the Oh, shut types, up. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Nobody says that! Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's <sighs> faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Okay, well, um, all right. Hey. Victoria uh, doesn't waste a sec. No Even book. her school books are gift wrapped. Gift wrapped? I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive, everything. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Dang. Alright, um, maybe don't leave your tech lying around, sweetie. Oh, okay, um, what That are you? printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. Kind of when love that, suck. like, color theory Someday. mug thing. That's kind of cute. Um, Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computer. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. That doesn't exactly look high school appropriate, but okay. Um, let's go talk to the little sweetie here, who's probably having the worst day ever. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. Uh, why, why would I... Why would I embarrass... Okay, uh... You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Aw. Oh. Victoria is already... That's so pessimistic! Oh my goodness! I hear that. Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Yes. Thanks, but not today. I have to go uh, over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. I like her hair. It it reminds me of um, like. Oh, I forget the I forget the name for it, but um, like I, I I don't remember if it was like Georgian or 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 I don't know something, but like the hairstyle comes from um, around the Art Nouveau era. Um, uh, the the uh, Lutece would be another example of um, wearing that hairstyle. But I, I like it. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. What? Purge. Wow. Okay. Um. Bye. Oh, what have we got here? Huh. This might make a cool shot. 
does that say amber amber something okay let's take a photo do some more exploring maybe steal some tech this is definitely where cameras go to heaven oh man they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses and look at that vintage rangefinder what um okay i took literally four years of photography classes i do not know what you just said <laughs> so cool that we can check these out anytime the decisive moment by nice, henry cartier bresson nice. okay that's rare any leap of its mad respect man he even has the best plasma hgtv for a class monitor can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy yeah that's more of a college thing even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Good! I hope we get to go there! I love woods. I love... I want to go there. I want to see it. You can never escape the lighthouse here. That... that's a, a strange way to put it, but okay. Cool. Um... Is that it for there? Take your thing. Boop. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still dig my huh. little instant camera. Let's, uh, stare at some people awkwardly. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Well, then we'll just look at her until she feels weird. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Yeah, teachers are scary. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. Thank I'd you. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Oh, you're still angry. Uh, I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better you know, photographer than a lot. Everyone has the now, same I, I amount of I know it's a drag work. to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. As a fellow art student, that was strangely inspiring. All right, um, I guess we'll go now. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying a you Welcome always to the real world. Just cute. Huh. Then I might send you a special picture to They're just getting you ready. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. She plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out I'm in the right here. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. It looks like there's a deployment coming. Always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Well, I mean, she probably has friends online. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Uh, he's got a bit of a case of doucher. I hate having everybody see inside my locker. See inside your locker? It's closed. It's not. I, I don't. I don't understand. Okay. I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. Okay. Yes, this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. Oh, yeah, totally, totally efficient. I think his name is 
Justin. Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. I shouldn't be so catty. Dana is nice to me. Yeah, don't be catty if she's nice to you. It's not cool. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. <laughs> I didn't come here to make friends. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Warren? Who's Warren? I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. I hate bully jock straps like Logan. And he's yeah, a vortex my club member. Man. Come on. Whoa, hey, out, out of my way. I wish October would last forever. Same. More birthday presents. <laughs> it looks like she's been gone for months. So that's what the etching on the table was. What that was, um, Rachel Amber forever. Huh. Okay. That's when I So she's missing. Probably gonna go hunt her down. Assuming she's still alive at least. Missed the poetry jam tryout, and I, I did not steal that backpack. I feel like there's a chance that she might be. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Help them! Good thing I left my AK at home. <laughs> Gun free zone. I don't know why they feel the need to like put that up at a school. That's, it's, I mean, it's, it's a school. They usually are gun free just by nature. They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Uh, I think I'd prefer the snacks. Thanks. Um, alright. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. What is the Vortex Club? There's Juliet from my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. He looks like quite the dude, bro. Can I talk to you? Yeah. God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of like that about him. Uh, you know, it's not a compliment if say that in that tone. He's cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. Let's see, who else can I talk to? to all of you, Principal's office. Principal doesn't come out of his office much. Okay. They usually don't. Miss Grant is a great American science teacher. Girls like dollies, uh, anything else we can do? No? Oh, uh, there's the bathroom. There's more things to look at. Can I see what is happening? Nerd alert. This poster has Warren written all over it. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. This is not a very clean bathroom. That's not very nice. Uh, what's that? The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Uh, sweetie, that's not that's not how vaccines work. That's not how it works. Take your vaccine, vaccinate your kids, and then we cannot have people dying all over the place. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Uh, maybe. Wouldn't rule it out. Okay. 
I I love that that like drawing on the mirror though. That's so funny. I love it. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Once more with feeling, dear. Fuck it. <gasps> no. Oh. Don't tear up your art. When a door closes, a window opens. Or I something like Julia that. Chase. We've got an Illuminati symbol. Okay, um, girl, you don't get a photo off like this every day. Get the butterfly, get the butterfly, get it, get it, get it. I'm gonna take a picture. I don't think this is relevant to everyday heroes, but I guess it's good for your portfolio in general. Um. Uh, uh, you do not look like a girl. I, I don't think you're supposed to be here. Uh. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> don't stress. Oh, you're okay. okay, bro. Just We've come got to three. The crazy. Great. Don't be scared. Wonderful. You own you this school. Always wanted. I wanted. I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Blue hair now, girl. Let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave What's them out happening? of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You uh, don't know who the fuck I am. Oh god. Or who you're messing around with. Oh no. Oh what are you doing? god, god, god. Come oh, on, no. put that thing down. Don't oh no. Ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people shit, trying shit, to control shit, me. Shit. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! No! I am emotionally invested already. Whoa. What the fuck? Uh, what the how, fuck indeed? How can that be? What the I fuck? Was in the bathroom. Indeed. He shot that poor girl. Okay. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Likely was. These pieces of time can frame us I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now to Kate is being hassled again. Uh, and if Victoria's phone rings, teacher, this is do real. something. Oh, now, shit. Oh, can you give well, me an example of a photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her. Hey. Noise. I the... did it. Can you give me I an actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a the human, human time machine. machine. Anybody? Bueller. Max, Bueller. don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images. Keep it together, of Max. Plot selfie. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. So totally when haunted. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. And frankly, it's bullshit. If he does again, I'll, I'll know this is for real. What kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm Tell not dreaming this. About my gift. You all know the it's real. Has been I can tell. Since the early 1800s. Your generation. So I can go back in time. Selfie mm -hmm. expression. What if that girl Sorry. isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom Long quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But yeah, you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there uh, anybody oh, here shit. who knows this? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. 
A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? My controller is vibrating very erratically and it's a little uncomfortable. Push. <laughs> More Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? That. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Yes, yeah, seriously, Taylor, take the opportunities you're given. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Um, okay. Even if you're submitting your photo for the Run! I see you, Max Caulfield. Shit. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Ugh. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. But, like, does Max, that count for the theme? Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. John Lennon. Don't let me stop you. Rumples a little Even if you're unnerving. submitting your photo for the competition, <laughs> everybody in class is turning in a photo. Talk to so me. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. <clears throat> I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. <laughs> I, I may or may not be cheating. Um, alright. Run, 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 run. Let's go. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Huh, huh, huh. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the I still say flew don't in, shred your photo. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing what around do, what with. Do, what do? What do? What are you oh, doing? God. Okay. Come uh, on, put that ever. thing down. Uh, Tell me what uh, to do. I need so a hammer to break it open. Okay, to where am I going to get a hammer? You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Oh, holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Hammer! Miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Oh, there's my photo. Another shitty day. He probably noticed that. That did not happen. See, this you is why you don't shred real. your art. It I just saw her messes up your alibis and, and stuff. Her. What the fuck is going on? Um, Do you not are freak keeping out. people alive. 
Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? <coughs> Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Thank Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Grr, pout. Yeah. Right back at ya. I should probably tell someone that there was a dude with a gun. That's you look a little stressed not out. cool. Are you okay? I'm, I'm Help me. just a little worried about my okay. future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all Help. you're thinking about? Help. You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Report. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family Ugh, and one of Blackwell's on. most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later Maybe in my with office. the police. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Though he's probably got them under his of thumb, too. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the uh, Prescott family owns will have Blackwell now. Consequences. Should I rewind and change my story? Uh, okay. Um. Well. My reasoning is that if I rewind, then the principal will probably suspect me of having done something wrong, since that's kind of the track he was going down. And Nathan will have seen my photo on the bathroom floor, so he'll know that I was probably there. Max, you better go on outside now. Shut up, I'm, I'm theorizing, okay? Um, I'm thinking. Um, so Nathan will probably know I was there and hunt me down, and the principal will have me in trouble for nothing. So I am going to at least get in trouble for a reason. <laughs>